Hello, hello! I am Jane Dapper, and you're watching Nail Clippers TV, the only celebrity interview show for the gays. With us today are two of the stars of the hit supernatural teen drama, Hot Teens and the Chupacabra. Lindsay Olivia Maltman, who plays Faith, and Ashley Leah Fordham, who plays Kelly. Thanks for being here, ladies. Thank you for having us. We're so excited. This is our first interview together for an um, LGBTQIA publication. Wow, there are so many letters. Which ones are we? Um, none, unless the A stands for ally. I couldn't really figure that out. Right. Um, so that leads me to my first question. As straight actresses, how did you feel about your characters being shipped together for so long? I honestly thought they were delusional. My character, Kelly, has slept with all of the hot teen guys and the chupacabra, who we all know is a guy. So I was really confused as to how she could clearly be into men, but then suddenly be into a woman. What she means is love comes from unexpected places. My head cheerleader character, Faith, for instance, has a large, rabid, queer fan base that I don't want to lose because I have to stay on this show as I'm 36 years old. Your characters have been shipped together since Kelly showed up at the monster bonfire in the flannel shirt in the season two finale. What took so long? Ratings dropped? It's really hard to up the ante once you've reached season 17, you know? I mean, last season when the Chupacabra slept with its own mom, it was like, where can we go from here? Yeah, we've paired up all of the straight couples and gay people were like mad. Cool. Let's take some questions from the Nail Clippers TV Snapchat audience. Um, fans of your couple, hashtag fake for Faith and Kelly sent in hundreds of questions. No, they didn't. They of course they did. Yeah, they did. They, did. Yeah, they, they did. love us. Hi, Fake. You guys gave me the courage to come out to my friends at my school. I was wondering, how did you feel when you found out the network was going to make your characters gay? Well, at first I was like, wait, what? Because I have long hair and I'm pretty. But then I called my agent and he was like, nah, it's cool now. Um, what she means is... It's an honor to be able to portray two beautiful, conventionally attractive women barely touching. My husband of three weeks was very supportive. It's a gift. I can't wait to take spots from actual LGBTQ actresses on the convention circuit for the rest of my career. Hi, big fan since the season seven Bigfoot twist. Okay, so since Kelly has dated men in the past and now she's in love with Faith, is there gonna be any mention of her bisexuality or? Oh, how did this question get in there? Uh, next. Hi, huge fan. I am a non-binary pansexual person and I was wondering if the show would ever feature a different kind of queer woman, like a butch woman or? Why? Hi, Lindsay. Hi, Ashley. So, was it awkward shooting that first love scene together? Well, it was a really tight set. The director, Ryan Lohman, insisted on being in the bed with us. Obviously, I've done hundreds of love scenes with the men on this show, but we really wanted to make sure we got this one right. Major Chup Groupie here. I was just, uh, Wanted to know, who are some of your favorite LGBTQ plus actors or actresses that are working these days? Um, uh, Ellen DeGeneres? What? Ellen's gay? Yes, I Googled it. Ah! I know, I was shocked. Did you know? Well, uh, thank you so much, ladies. Our LGBTQIA plus audience really appreciates you telling our stories. <clears throat> Up next, I know we promised the new queer cast of the new queer show directed by queer directors with an all queer writing staff and all queer crew, but that show has been canceled. 